Another new feature to DragonFrame 4 is our live record. So with certain cameras that can shoot and capture live video, we give you a control for it now. So I've got the uh, Canon 5D hooked up right now. If you go into Capture and down to Movie Recording, you get this little floating control panel. And you've got some different icons on here. You can record to the card and have it brought back onto the computer when it's done recording, or you can record just to the card on the camera. And you can turn on or off, um, if it's applicable, the um, audio. Just so I had something to move while we're recording, I've set up a motion control shot. You don't have to have motion control to use the movie recording, but um, I just thought this would be a way to show something moving. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna hit record here, start the recording, and once the recording's going, I'm going to hit play on the motion control, and we're going to record the move. Here we go. And we're running. Now you won't see this updating because all the video is going to the card, so the live view doesn't update while that happens, which is fine. If I hit the three key and go to the light, oh, oh, got to stop that. Okay, so now it's downloading the file because I have this card plus computer selected. And if we go to the cinematography window, we will soon see this show up as, there we go. We have the little movie icon in the upper right-hand corner. And here, I'll move this over to the side. If I click on this, uh, well, so here's the stills, and then here's the video. And you see we've got a... Um, We've got a little video here, so I'm going to turn this down, and I'll hit play. There it goes. So we've gotten many requests over the years, is there some way to shoot live video from the setup in DragonFrame? And so here's a way to, to do that with certain cameras.